all fled into the net. You pushing bullshit. Heard more than my share of tales about runners who ran off the Never Never Netland. Just never thought you'd be the next to tell me one. Don't need you to believe me, long as you do exactly what I say. When'd you find out? When she made contact a little later. And? What'd she say? That she was a captive in the Arasaka subnet. But they couldn't hurt her. And she told me not to come looking for her. What? Why? This one time, she wanted me to just let it go. Cause enough people had died for nothing already. So... What did you do? Got my hands on two thermonuclear charges. Then headed back to Arasaka Tower. How do you know all still around? It's been half a century. But you've spent cloistered in Mikoshi. Netwatch could have hunted her down years ago. Oh, they tried, believe me. But their tiny corporate brains can't handle a free AI that knows how people think. They were busy looking for her in the Crystal Palace while she was building the Ghost City for King Tao. The rogue went with you. Again. I paid her well. Said to yourself, she was the best. Had her pick of contracts. But for some strange-ass reason, she took a job from a rocker with a death wish. A rocker forever getting his ass beat by Arasaka. Different times, kid. Back then, marks didn't normally sell out to corpse. All you had to do was yell, let's fuck up Arasaka, and every last one would jizz their pants. Rogue included. Voodoo boys think they know where she is, beyond the Black Wall. Where nobody can touch her. Brigitte's primed to go there, break through, just to contact the Alt, talk to her. Too much for our little pro. So, did it work? Yes. We extract a necessary fragment of Silverhand's anger. We are ready now to make contact with Alt. First, we must dive deeper. Your turn. 
before you pass through that wall, I want Johnny Psyche removed. We will not pass through. You will take the code to the other side. Fuck. Might have guessed. Never had any intention of helping me, did you? It does not matter anymore. You will bring all to its end. Don't got much for options, do I? Ale. Brigitte. Attacking network land. What the hell is going on? They breached our BBSs. We have nothing to do with this. Now watch. What? What? Take him out. That watch was well prepared this time. Gotta be Mosley, the fucker. What if Brigitte and the Voodoo Boys? I was forced to purge them. That watch was exploiting their BBS. Purge? You mean they're dead, all of them? Not actually gonna feel bad for them, are you? Damn it. I brought Netwatch here. Agent I dealt with must have slipped me a tracker that let him right in. Switch things up on the sly, replacing the Voodoo's virus with his own brand of rod. Probably how they got to you. It matters not. The entire subnet was destroyed. Alt, you pulled us out of there. That mean you and us were okay? Everything's chill? I have recognized your engram code, but I do not know why you are here. So you can pay me back for getting you out of our Saga Tower. V, this is Alt. Best Netrunner Night City's ever seen. Alt, this is V. You need to save his life. This chip, the relic, it's killing me. Construct on it's worming its way through my neural system. I see this, but why is it my problem? Why the fuck isn't it? You created Soul Killer. You handed Arasaka a fucking super weapon that dismantled me, you, and half the runners in Night City. Your death was of your own making. Jesus, Alt, I dove in after you. Gonna tell me now this ain't your problem? It is not. The Alt Cunningham you strove to save in Arasaka Tower no longer exists. This should be obvious to you, as you were responsible for her death. Mind unloading this baggage later? I wasn't sure what to expect from a meeting with an AI, but it sure wasn't a digital spat. How's that help me exactly? That didn't make it any worse. Alt, who are you? I use her engrammatic data. Really? You find this icy bitch aspect in there too? Your death wasn't Johnny's fault. How could you know? Seen you in his memories. It was an accident. What you saw was his subjective view of what happened. A warped account of events he locked away in his subconscious and replayed time and again. It bears no resemblance to the truth.